Well, Leo Terrell is a civil rights attorney who has been a staple on cable talk shows and L.A. airwaves for the longest time. Mr. Terrell was a powerful voice on the left, but in 2020, Leo Terrell raised quite a lot of eyebrows when he publicly announced that he would make Donald J. Trump, Donald J. Trump his first Republican president vote. That was the first time he's going to vote for a Republican. He is the host of the podcast, Leo Terrell's America's Finest Civil Rights Attorney, and he is making his KUSI debut, and we could not be more proud of that. Leo, welcome to KUSI. Paul, thanks for having me. Glad to be here. Before we start talking national politics, can we talk AB5, sir? You know some of the players involved. In fact, you've had conversations with the Lorena Gonzalez's of the world. What's your take on AB5? Uh, very simple. First of all, I've been an employment lawyer for 30 years. AB5 is a horrible bill. It was designed for one reason, Paul, to try to unionize low-paying workers. That's the whole purpose of this. And this bill is so bad, that's why you have the most expensive proposition on the ballot. And the state legislature is had basically did a carve-out because during this pandemic, it wrecked the, the ability of people to get a job because of this requirement to be an employee. People don't want to be an employee. They want to be independent contractors. So how does Lorena Gonzalez respond to you when you bring that up? You know, I had... I basically tweeted her to death along with the governor and spoke to her spokesperson and they set up a meeting with Lorena and we went back and forth. She was professional. I'll give her credit for that. But there was no budging from her. And I think it's because she knows she's made a mistake. She will not concede in public. She's going to get the referendum in November. And this carve out is a fact, Paul, that people have rejected AB5. It has hurt writers, journalists, musicians employees during the pandemic, Paul, who want to work as independent contractors. Lorena Gonzalez wants everyone unionized. Well, she would say that she's just trying to protect the rights of the workers, giving everybody uh, the right to benefits and whatnot. Let me let me respond to that. You know, the initial AB5 bill carved out certain jobs like lawyers, like doctors. Don't they have a concern? She targeted specific individuals drivers, worker. And Paul, let's be honest, the elephant in the room, she wants to unionize it. She wants that union contribution to the Democratic Party, and she wants to run for statewide office. That's the elephant in the room. Everyone knows that at the expense of hurting people who were out of work because employers would not hire them in the capacity as an independent contractor. 